What's up, Shad back with you. I know it's been a little bit. I try to hold this camera steady inside the cab of my beautiful truck. It's getting, uh, you know, to be hot out summertime. I know some of you guys are thinking about buying some SA Company shields and whatnot. And uh, just wanted to see somebody behind me. I guess not. I just wanted to do a review on their shields because I wear them like every day. Um, face shields, you know, hats, the hats. If you're gonna get a hat, one of these hats, uh, if you sit still, you know what I mean? Like you're not on a mower or anything, but if you're like weed eating, these are pretty good. If not, the brims fly up on them while you're, you know, just riding down uh, on your mower or if there's a gust of wind, the, the, the uh, this part keeps like, got it tied up right now, but this will flip up like that. That's the way you'll look. So it doesn't really block your face that much. Um, it's really big too. I mean, I have a giant head and I have a seven and three eighths head and there's still room in here. So if you got a small head, you definitely want to wear a bandana or something with it. Does it, you know, give shade and sure, you know, if you're just weed eating and if there's not a strong gusty wind, if there's a gusty wind, this isn't really your friend. Huh, that rhymed. Um, you know, because this lip will constantly fly up. The sun's going to be in your face. So I would give this, oh, I don't know maybe a five out of 10. Um, I think they should put weights or something on the bottom. See how you can tie it up, you know, with the strap, the chin strap. I think they should do something like that to where you can tie it down. You can't tie it down. There's a little strap in the back, but it doesn't hold the edges down. There should be a way to hold them down. That would help a lot. As for the face shields, I don't use these to block dirt and debris and stuff. I'm a mouth breather. So I'm like, yes, usually, all right. And, uh, that means bugs and grass and stuff flies in my mouth. So that's what I usually use it for. Also sunblock, this is great sunblock. It keeps the the uh, UV rays from getting to your skin. I, you know, I don't have to put uh, sunblock like right here usually where my mask doesn't go. But as for keeping anything out, dirt, debris, I'm still picking, you know, dirt burgers out of my nose when I wear this. So it does not keep out dirt. It is, not really keep out uh, chemicals. I wouldn't be spraying with this mask on. But uh, if you're just needing something to keep bugs and sticks and uh, grass clippings out of your mouth and keep you uh, protected from the sun, yeah, these are good. So hope that helped anybody looking to uh, buy some SA gear, um, especially if you're working outside for the first time. And uh, hope that helps. So I would say Get the mask if you need it for sun protection. Skip the hat unless you're pretty stationary with no wind all the time. All right, jab out.